45 minutes and a zero increment game this so it's classical this is what we've been relaxing and chilling for this is why we needed to re-energize okay let's get the plane really quick so we're going to just capture here get the queen off the board with a check we can come round and attack the pawn, but his bishop just comes and does that annoying defense thing, doesn't it? So we'll do it for now anyway. Got this pawn here, potentially a little bit of a fork. Okay, so we will grab the pawn then. He does have access to that pawn as well, so they will take that, obviously. Do they lose a bit of tempo if we bring that down? No, just attack the bishop. Let's just attack the bishop. Let's bring the knight down. Shall we hit the knight with the pawn? And is it still attacking? So let's open up the dark square bishop. I don't want to fall into the speed aspect. We did the chilling to relax and find the better moves. That five minutes of relax and calm and chill. Could attack the bishop. I think we're just going to do that. Put a check on the king first. Bait the pawn down. And then come back and attack the bishop. Oh, okay. So we're plus one. King's going to have to move. So it's disheveling the king a little bit. Just wish the knight had somewhere else to... You know, something else to grab onto, but it doesn't. So we'll probably get access to... Oh, it's got him defending the pawn as well. Damn. So that's where we want to go. And then he just drops his pawn. And then we have to come back again. So maybe we just hold on to that and double the rooks. I'm going to double the rooks. Because there's no point. We're just going to end up dancing around. Oh, he's x-raying through to the pawn that's unprotected who's faster so he's going to basically get his king kind of castle moving his king there so if we move up so if we move the rook across then he moves his king and his king is protecting one pawn so we can move here his pawn pushes down, attacking the rook. Alright, is there anything else? Move the knight, attacking the pawn, giving them something to think about. Mm -mm -mm. Pushes the pawn onto the knight. Rook can come and put a check on the king. King moves to the square that it wanted to go to. Get this rook defending the pawn. Okay, we'll give that a try. I think that looks better than going the other way. They might not attack the pawn, but knight, but oh, he's not. He's just really hungry for this pawn. <laughs> okay. So we could take their pawn, he takes, but we don't want them owning anything. So it has changed the picture of it a little bit. So we're going to have to bring the rook here. Now they've gone with the pawn thing. So the knight can put a check on their king, or we can bring the rook up. But I'm going to put a check on the king. So he goes deeper into the rabbit hole. Could come here, but his knight's there. Looks like my knight's kind of trapped, doesn't it? Eek. Going to hit their knight. Just to get it out of the equation. Is he coming here? Oh, let's take that off the board. Thank you very much. Uh, oh, he's got this pawn. So I was ready to go go in here, but he's got that pawn. So if we go here... Then he's going to double his rooks onto this pawn, giving us things to think about. So if we go here, we do have that danger spot of this happening. 
and then if we move across then he's got this happening and then our gut's kind of trapped in that center hmm interesting so it looks like i'm gonna to have to defend the pawn So we're still plus one, none of them are doubled at the minute and he's looking to get rid of pawns, so we'll gladly take. Right, so just going to budge a little bit up because I think he's probably looking at coming here with the rook. He's wanting to get rid of pawns because the thing is, if we have a look at this situation, when we take, then he takes again. If we take, then he wins the rook. So we're going to have to get the king moved up at a point, which is going to be this point now. Although then it gives them the pawn back either way. So we do have a check on the king, which I don't know if that wins us. It doesn't win us anything because it's still going to take our pawn. Hmm. So we get the check. King moves say, here. So we might have to resign ourselves to the fact that he's going to get the pawn back. Because we can't take, because then this rook gets taken with a check. Is there anything better? Yeah, this king would have been better here, but it's not there, so we can't do anything about that. Check. All oh, check. One, one on the bottom. Check. Does it make any difference? Checks. Bring the rook here. So then if he does take, then we can take. But I think they're going to take with the rook, aren't they? Because they've got two. So they'll still get the pawn back. Ah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. We go here, check, he moves, we go there, and he'll go, yeah, I've got your pawn. You've already got a rook, so we'll take back, and the pawn takes. Put a check on the king, but he just comes here. And the king and the rook are going to have to contend. We do have this past pawn, which might look okay for us for the end game. All right, let's play it out that way. Let's play it out that way. Yep. Because of this extra pawn on, well, it's not extra pawn, this past pawn on the far side. And he has moved to a different place with the king. Does that make any difference at all? Could bring the rook here now, the pawn can't take. Could bring the rook here. Pawn can't take. We're still running into situation, aren't we? The pawn can't take, but his rook can take the pawn, can't it? Yeah, that's the thing. Right, let's continue with what we said. And we're hoping that this pawn is going to be the saving grace because the king can help support. It's actually taken with the pawn, not taken with the rook. That's a horse of a different colour, isn't it? Rook can come here with a check. And it's almost... No, he, he can move. I was just going to think he, he had to bring his rook here. But he goes there. Then we hit him with the rook here. Oh, no, in fact, we could just... Yeah, take his rook off the board. Ouch. Put a check on. It's King can't come into this square. He, can't, he's, he has to go to this square. So then we can take the rook off the board. Oh, <laughs> that's worked out lovely. I think they should have just taken with the rook. That's what we were. So I'm going to get his other rook off. Oh, <laughs> poor thing. Oh, I'm going to get the pawn off now. Oh, that's worked out brilliantly. Oh, that five minute break. That's worked wonders. And they've resigned.